can we interrupt this program now to carry on? What are you running for, sir? I don't know. I, I should have decided a few months ago what office I needed to run for and ran for something, right? I fell out of place up here. Well, I, I still I respect your full support when I ran for probate judge. I did. I supported you for, what, those three, four days? <laughs> Ten days. Ten days. Ten days. We yeah. tried to get out after a week, but we kept. They, we didn't disqualify ourselves, Tim. Uh, There's a correct and incorrect way to do that, and we were doing it the incorrect way, weren't we, Tom? We ended up getting it right. Well, we're, we were so trying to. Trying get to. Yeah. You're trying to go under the radar just to make oh, it to yeah. the vote and see. All what right. Happens. Anything different for summer? Still getting out of that Chick Fil A? Um, well, you know, we got a few things happening this summer. Later this summer, we're going to roll out some, some new coffee and, and some iced coffee. So um, mm. that's coming in late July. And mm. we just rolled out our new charter a, a month or so ago. So. Betty, I'm going to ask you, uh, I don't know if people may take advantage of you like I'm about to. but uh, <laughs> They usually do. Well, yeah. is it okay? It's Maddie's too now. Sometimes she kind of gets on my nerves. If we just pull up and just, what if we just leave her there for a while and just say, hey, Matthew, we're going to leave Maddie here for a couple hours. Can she just play in there by herself I would never in the do that. playground and well, then we'll just take, I'll come back and get her a couple hours? Well, if you brought Maddie and told me she was there, I'd watch her for you for a couple hours. So You see, Tim, Matthew tried to hire me once down there. And now, I don't know to, that he to, tried to, to hire mingle with people. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you were on well, it just happened to have this couple was coming through from Texas and I gave them oh, a to get somewhere. It just so happened to be Alabama just beat them. And it's, you know, our first national championship. So he had to go. I had to bring that up. <laughs> Can't believe y'all drive through Alabama. We just stomped y'all out of good boys. <laughs> I've been in back. You know, I, know. I haven't <laughs> seen them, but I'm sure if they do, they'll go. Remember the last time I was here? Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm Can't sure wait they'll to go back. That's right. Hey, that's Sarah Evans you know. comes through. You know, they got that Rock the South coming up over Sarah in Columbus. Sarah stops by the Grab all the time. Us a few tickets. For all right, well, I'll, I'll talk to her and see if I'm in, because, you know, we're, we're pretty tight. We're just oh, like yeah. this. They know. stop in there all the time. We Jay went to different high schools really? together. Yeah, they park, they come down, and she'll sing a few songs. Don't you do it? Right, we just breaks out a mini concert right here in Chick-fil-A. But you never call me. Well, you know, I mean, we do have people stop in. Luke Bryan's been there. We've had, uh, what? you know, your friend Jeff Cook's been there a couple of times. So yeah. you get Jeff all kinds of people. <laughs> hey, man, hey, watch it. <laughs> hey, watch it. <laughs> oh, you know, he does over in Gunnersville now. He's a big uh, fisherman. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Got to stop in Chick-fil-A. Hey, Tom, everybody getting kind of caught. Y'all, st all you insurance agents, y'all working yourselves today? Well, it, it's been hectic, but that's what we uh, are there for because... You know, when you buy a policy, you, if something happens, you want somebody to come and, and take care of the situation. You can't change the situation, but you can make it better. Hey, I was talking to Jimmy. Yeah, Jimmy good. came by yesterday right. with Don Carter. He handled a lot of stuff at our house. They lived on Log Cabin Road. Right. Mm -hmm. uh, I gave him three T-shirts because he's lost all of his clothes. He said it was one of the scariest diets he'd ever had. I said, well, he was in the bathtub with a 14-year-old girl, his wife, their 10-month-old baby, two dogs. He said, as soon as it was over, they'd get up and get in a vehicle. He said, what was so amazing, he was scared to death then. He went to the, he and just that moment. He said, power lines down, everything, and they're driving through. He said, we get to Athens, there's people in the drive-through, the Chick-fil-A, Taco Bell, and everything. It's like nothing happened. Oh, wow. mm -hmm. Yeah. And, and nothing did happen in that area, but he said, he said it was, it was so scary. Unusual. 15 seconds. So since you're not running for anything, let's talk to Tim Melson here again, Dr. Melson. <laughs> because <honey>. he is. <laughs> you know, what's the one thing you've learned about this, this county? Well, there's point? a lot of, I think I mentioned this before, there's a lot of unique people out there with different things that make them uh, uh, passionate about uh, politics, you know, a lot of different issues that, that you would never even consider, you know, people. And, and that you can't even do anything about, but because you're running, they, they want to talk to you about it. But do you, do you get much rest? Yeah, I mean, if you... <laughs> well, nah, not much, but uh, <laughs> to be honest. No, you know, you, you're on the road right now. It, it'll all come to end June 4th, and we'll see what happens. Or maybe a runoff may not. You never know. But uh, just suck it up and go for, for the next What would you like to say to the people out there right now, though, as well, you get ready to go your last just, week? Just, I would like for them to know that... Uh, that no matter where you live in the valley, if I'm elected, I'll represent them and, right. uh, and take their interest to heart. So, right. you know, it's, and please vote for me June 3rd. So. All right, Dr. Tim. He Mouse, doesn't say remember? take that to All heart right. lightly. Well, let me remind y'all, I ain't gonna be here next week, Matthew. I'll be in town, so if you need me, I'll come by and help you out. I'll need me. Yeah. I could actually use a couple hours babysitting. Can I drop him off? Yeah. <laughs> drop him off. Wait a minute, that was Maddie. Oh. Maddie. No. The rodeo okay. replaces the show next week. Y'all will see it. The 32nd annual Limestone County Sheriff's Rodeo replaces more than y'all. Like I said, y'all will know every bull and calf by its name no by the time doubt. this is over at Mac. Can you wake up, Lynn? I'm trying to finish.
Sage up here. Let him rest. Start to snore right. on me over in that corner. <laughs> it's going here. Anyway, y'all be sure to watch that. Y'all need anything? You still hit me up. Country Rover at gmail.com is my iPad. Almost there forgot it right there. Thank y'all for being with us. We'll take a week off. We'll see y'all okay. on Election Day. Ooh. So y'all be back for that. Right now we got to go. Y'all have a great Memorial Day and go out and honor all the servicemen and everything and have a great day and cook something up. We'll see y'all. Bye. Bye.